Coming up next, Senior Frontline Jerusalem host, Earl Cox. Today we are at the Biblical Zoo with a very special person, Rachel Risby Roz, who is the International Relations Manager. Rachel? Well, firstly, welcome to the zoo. As you can see, it is a magical place. It is magical. And as Kathleen explained, it is probably one of the very few attractions in Israel where you'll come here and you will see all the different segments of, of Israeli society. There's two reasons why it's called the Biblical Zoo. The first one is because here at our zoo we have the largest collection of animals mentioned in the Bible. Okay, a lot of zoos all over the world have animals who are mentioned in the Bible, but here we have the actual specific type of animal who are native wow. to this region at the time when the Bible took place. I'm Kathleen Cox at the Biblical Zoo in Jerusalem, and please support this station because it supports Israel. Thank <laughs> you.